Hey everybody, welcome back. So today we are on our hunt. Uh, we are attempting to find ourselves uh, a destroyer. I might have said battle cruiser accidentally um, before, and it was funny because uh, you remember we had some missions over here. I'm gonna actually go to it quickly. I think it was in that one here. Well, I actually ended up finding exactly what we were looking for. Um, except that wasn't what we were looking for. We were looking for a destroyer, but I think at some point I might have accidentally said battle cruiser. I'm not sure why. In my head, it was you know we had a battle cruiser thing going on. Um, so oh, I guess we we're in the system. Yeah. So this Astrox uh, Security Patrol. We had a mission we handed in uh, Dog uh, Star Prime. So I thought, oh, you know what? Um, you know, on my way back, I'll check this place out because uh, it looked cool. You know, the symbol and everything. I'm like, what is this about? I didn't even realize it was a station at first. I thought it was something else, and I'm like, oh, that's a station derp. Um, but I checked the shipyard anyways, and I found the a battle cruiser. Now the battle cruiser is one above the destroyer. And so we don't actually have the skill for it. It'll cry and I don't want to get it right now because you have to get the uh, the other skill up to like three or whatever um, So yeah, anyways, this this cool badass one is here. It's a recon one uh, all about guns on this one So that's cool nine uh, hard points uh, eight uh, passive and uh, lots of cargo and stuff. So yeah, well, we'll remember this is one exists. It might not be there later It's an alpha ship. It's one of our ships oddly enough. So um yeah, that's, that's actually really cool to know that is there. So I've decided today what we're going to do, since it's the most explored one outside of the uh, other ones so far. I've decided, ooh, there's a pirate one there I didn't do, but whatever. Uh, I thought I would go ahead and start uh, checking out trade. Uh, I just wanted to get trade all explored and done anyways, so I thought, you know what, we'll uh, we'll do trade and we'll do a, like a like a whole episode of just exploring, you know, the ins and out of trade and, uh, you know, more likely we won't probably find anything. Well, you might. You never know, right? But I thought, well, we'll check it out. We'll check some of the stations out, things like that. Um, and uh, we'll go from there and uh, see what we come up with. So it's not it's not so hard with this, uh, this ship, obviously, to go around and scan and check things out. So I thought, let's just do it, you know. So uh, here's the system. Oh, it has a station here, which is good. And... Uh, Oh, I, these are already... Oh, I must have already been here. Oh, no, we're going to another... Sorry, derp. We're going to the system beside. I'm like, I've already been here, apparently. Uh, so let's check the station anyways, and then we're going to head to the Gemini one. So... Doesn't even have a thing here, so that makes life a little easier. Uh, I always like to check out, you know, different things like here. Merc speeds. Look at that. That's interesting. Uh, ship mass... Yeah, nothing uh, too, too uh, interesting here, but I do like to check out, you know, the markets and stuff. Um, this I should switch here. This is interesting, but I always find this this hard to uh, follow. I have learned a bit on trading the best way to do it. Don't ever look through it and be like, oh, look at they have a lot of quantities or something of something. And, you know, just go based on what they supply and what something demands. You don't go based on anything else because for some reason this has a huge modifier. So even if they supply like oil and they only have 31 quantities like no oil at all uh they're still gonna sell it cheaper than the base price kind of thing it's kind of weird on that um but yeah these things look at how little quantity it is. it's not it's not worth my time you know what i mean so that's why i basically ignore uh trading unfortunately but i have learned that uh, the way to go is not based on stocks even um it's just basically on the supply and demand and just follow that only because that's that's where you're gonna get your stuff at basically uh, so I do like to check these, you know, make sure, you know, we don't have something that's uh, a little bit better. This is a level four eco-regulator life support. Um, but I don't think that's as good as what we've seen or have. Um, and then uh, sometimes these ones, premium. So you got your premium stuff here. Premium mass reduction. It's actually pretty nice. Uh, this stuff's pretty heavy for me to carry around here, but I like to check, you know, what there is out there anyway. So... Um, turn thrust. Look at this, 20%. That's actually pretty important. Like a big ship like what we're looking for, that actually might uh, become something that we would really want, honestly. So um, we'll have to keep an eye on that. So we're going to go to this one here. This is the new system, right? Yep. And there's nothing in here for us. Okay, so we'll go scan that one and we'll go back through here and then we'll open the map here and we are going to check out... Oh, no, sorry. There was two gates in there. I'm a I'm a noob. I didn't. How did I miss a whole gate in there? I scan two gates and then I go back. I'm like, oh yeah, there's nothing in here. That was a brain fart. 
Okay, we're we're doing our fun thing where we're just going in circles right now. There you go. Why why are you continuing? There there you're not even supposed to continue anywhere. Where are you? Why are you shooting away? What what are you doing? You you're not even what <laughs> You just goal. It's like it has the you know how like in space uh you know the endless momentum but it's moving. Watch this. So I'll go towards this. Watch this. I'll go towards this, right? So we're going towards it. Watch this. <laughs> It's like there's a current going on or something. What the frick? <laughs> well, we bugged that one out. Okay, well, uh, let's head to the station then and let's check this. So there's even two more. So obviously lots of stuff here to check out. But um, man, that's funny. Uh... Oh, you got to admit that was pretty good. Okay, so uh, what do we got here? Uh, shipyard. Uh, so, whoa, the Mueller. We've already seen this a million times. Pretty cool. Um, do, 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 do. Yeah, nothing too cool. I mean, that's all cool, honestly. It's just I have I have something in my head, and I want that. I don't want anything else. You know what I mean? So it's just how it is. Um, so where did we come out of? We There is uh, Ellie and some something out there. Which one's first? I guess you, because you show up. And just make sure we had the scan of everything. Yeah, I don't scan these things anymore. I've learned my lesson not to scan those. Um, okay. And, oh, look at this. This keeps going. It's the place that keeps going and going. So let's go. I love the darkness in this one, though. Cool. And uh, there's a station here, too. Look at this. So let's check that one. The Imperium Bank. That sounds badass. And it has a shipyard. Well, it makes sense that banks have shipyards. They're, they're rich enough. <laughs> the market. Uh, so let's check these guys. So this is the Omni whatever life support one. This is actually a pretty cool one. I probably should grab it because, I mean, it makes you last like a million. No cargo for it. This is one thing I'm a little sad by. And maybe there's a way. Maybe there isn't. Like, I'm surprised there's no, like... You know, maybe there is, and I just don't see it. Like, usable items, no. I, I don't know. I've just, I, you think there would be a way to just tell it to go to the sh station instead of your ship if you if you choose to, you know what I mean? But uh, either way, whatever. I just ignore those for now. I guess uh, I'll have to hunt here with an actual thing. So we came through this one, right? So we're going through this one now. I like to check out, but we're kind of zooming so fast. Wow, this is so bright. This is an 8.9 system. I like these empty systems. I guess they're kind of like, this is a system for yourself, you know? Like, you can go ahead and uh, take this if you wanted to. But isn't that so cool? Like, look how dark it is. And that's a Zayor. Oh, it's got the lightning effects in here, too. Oh, no, we don't like you. Go away. Okay, so let's uh, go through here. So what are we, what are we looking at now here? Um, we probably have to use the map here. So nothing coming out. Okay, so we're going back all the way here. No, I didn't run this. Oh, whatever. They, they, to run this, it just takes too much time. This is like an off-camera thing, um, and then I could just run that in between and stuff. It's just, it's just too much. Uh, it does take a lot of time to scan for those wormholes. Okay, so uh, we're in this system, and uh, oh yeah, we're going to this one next. Ely, Ely, E, E, L, E, E, L, E. I mean, you could pretty much call it that, Ely, E, L, E. I'm just saying the E and L and E, E, L, E. I know, I'm an idiot. There's another thing here. There's multiple stations here. The Zelon, the Zelon. That sounds actually kind of. Pretty badass sounding. Oh, but we wanted to go to the Zelon. No. We still want to go there. Okay, we're going now. <laughs> okay. Uh, shipyard. So what do we got? Oh, a ship called a destroyer. Oh my goodness, we found it. 
we found well i don't know if it's it there's probably multiple destroyers but we found a destroyer Ooh, look at the life support 1200 oh my goodness that life support is beautiful because our ship is like what 550 650 something like that our main one so 54 100 shields 3900 uh armor 4200 energy um the other stuff is usually useless uh, the the turn speed is only 0 0.30 recharge rate scan uh, range it's not too too bad uh, nine targets and what's this bonus oh okay so eight hard points seven passive awesome 300 and 3971 um, storage a bit odd on the the weird numbers there that could just be our skill affecting that though uh, scan speed bonus 50%, pulse speed uh, bonus 30%, scan range bonus 60%, so lots of good scanning stuff. Max target bonus 50%, so you're going to have a lot more targets too. Uh, gun speed bonus 50%, gun strength bonus 65%, laser strength bonus 50%. Nice, this one actually will let me use lasers and get a bonus out of it. What is this thing? The Kraken. Look at that. I like the look of that one, too, actually. It looks really badass. So let's go ahead and buy our destroyer, shall we? Yeah, let's do it. You've purchased. There we go. So now we are the proud owner of a destroyer. And that was a pretty expensive price. Um, but uh, I think well worth it in the end. So life support. Oh, you can get grilled steak for it. Um, that's level... level. Oh, no. We have level 6 food, right? Um, so that's not going to be good. Um, what about lasers? I mean, obviously you could put lasers on here, but I mean, uh, which lasers are you going to put on here? Because none of these will probably work. Oh, yeah, I could put these ones. This one is better than the ones we have, I guess, because they're level four. But we need, uh, yeah, I would like to have these ones here, but we need level seven. And we don't have that. So it would be funny if they had laser, oh, laser maintenance. Oh, you're a jerk. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I don't know if I should try. What is my lasers at, anyways? Level four. Oh, so the other ones, that's the best you're going to get anyway. So you might as well get them. My, you know, why not, right? If it's the best you have, go for it. Now, the only thing is, it's not like I was weak for combat at all. That's, that's the downside to this whole thing is I wasn't weak. I wanted something where I can try to go into the wormhole and see if I can last two seconds and uh without you know doing the whole you know fleet stuff and so that's what i was kind of thinking about so oh and there there's only two quantities on here okay we'll buy them i mean they're pennies right so we'll buy them and then um yeah we'll just deal with that after i guess and uh should we switch let's switch i guess um, I was gonna just, you know, not fly around with it, but we, we can fly around with it. It's painful, but, uh, why not? Activate ship. There you go. I'll even leave his life support. His life support's too badass for what he's used for, so. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and, uh, mark it here. So what about passive slots? We want prototype if we're doing anything. So energy recharge is 100, 100 on that thing. 1.4 mil, though. Um, you know what? We're going to use energy, right? So maybe that's not a bad one to have. Let's just buy one. Because we got lots of passives, right? So let's just buy one. It's, it's a prototype. So it's not like we're we're wasting, uh, you know, like it's obviously pretty good. They even have an armor one, explosive resistance. So it's different, like, resistance, I guess, you can have. So that's pretty cool. Um, uh, but, uh, yeah, let's just keep, let's just stay with prototype then, uh, just for this kind of stuff. And then what about active? Is there any other cool active ones? I mean, there's even this stuff, but this is like, well, this is the beam ones. Yeah. Torpedo launcher stuff. Obviously like this stuff is way out of my league, you know, because of, uh, this is a harvester minor, a level seven harvester. Oh, damn. That's badass. Okay. So... Is that it for the hard points completely? Yeah, I guess so. So there's not a lot here for us, really. Uh, grilled steak, or we can ignore it for now. I think I might ignore it. I don't know how bad that of an idea that is. Um, that probably is going to be a very bad idea, but we'll, I guess we'll find out. 
<laughs> as long as we can make it from one station to another, I guess that's fine. But uh, it's like I don't want to waste my money on crap, right? So I could I could take out what we have in our other ship, I guess. Um, we would lose. Yeah, we, we'd lose that. But you know what? Let's just do it. Let's do it. Um, so let's go to shipyard. We'll go to ship dock. Bye, my friend. We're going to have to uh, get you out a bit here. So we're going to go to life support, and we're going to get all this out, unfortunately. That's fine. And then... It'd be funny if you can get it out. It's like no room. It's like, but how did I... Yeah, how would you do that if you can't get something out and you have no... The freaking cargo stuff could be pretty damn confusing for that. Um, anyways, back to shipyard here. Oh, and ship docks. There we go. Activate. There you go. This is another thing I didn't check out. So what are we looking at? What's our cargo on this? 5,559. Damn. That's without any expanders or anything like that. Okay, so let's go to the garage and life support. So this starts out a pretty high, right? So that just doubled it, basically. <laughs> Almost. Um, but uh, anyways, we'll just throw this stuff in here. And there you go. So now we have uh, 3,000 li uh, life support. So that thing's got good enough life support now. Uh, might as well put our two lasers on there. That's enough to probably kill anything we've fought so far. Obviously, uh, I want to put more on there. It's just funny looking at the... We got a scroll. Okay. Oh, and then we were going to put this on here. The first passive of ours. Um, ship you Oh, not shipyard. Silly garage. There you go. Oh, yeah. We're going to throw this as a passive. So, prototype energy generator. And you can, if you want, you can, I guess, move it back here. Forever. And, uh, okay, so, uh, at least, you know, you know, you probably don't have to worry about running out of energy anytime soon, so. Isn't that cool? What's it, uh, there you go. Awesome. Okay, so, what are we up to? Uh, fair, fair, fear, fair. Is next. Oh, we didn't actually check out this station. Yeah, so you can see the turn is pretty slow, but that's expected. We could get the prototype. I probably will throw the prototype uh, turning thing on it. Heck, you could even put two of them on them if it if it makes your your life night and day, right? Our speed's pretty slow. This is with boost, 179, 76 without any boost. So you're probably going to want some speed passives as well if you want to move faster in space. Moving faster means less death too when it comes to fighting, but also when it comes to uh, like so running away, but also life support, right? If you getting out of a place and getting moving faster saves you saves your life, right? Then obviously that's a big deal. Um, oh, look at the dragonfly. Okay, so uh, market here. Let's check you. Nothing good there. Uh, let's look for lasers again. So we're looking for. What's well, the item level? I wonder why there's... I guess it's like a rare type or something? It's like named lasers anyways. Yeah, it's so confusing. 18 DPS, so it's not even that special compared to, you know... I guess it's like min-max maybe? So what is this one? A prototype? Or, oh, protonic large laser, sorry. That requires a lot more uh, skill. So uh, we got three more here we can get anyway, so let's grab them. So we'll grab those, and uh, what about the passive slots? Uh, so armor, recharge rate, um, all that's for shields. That might be interesting. I might grab that, to be honest. Oh, it's out. <laughs> no, I won't be grabbing it. Um, okay, so let's put these guys on here. Oh, this one doesn't have a thing on it, so that's fine. And then we were going to check out this fear place. And then we didn't mark our gate getting out of here, I guess, after. There you go. <laughs> I like how slow we're going. It makes it more exciting. Okay, so what do we have here? Nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, so let's go and uh, I guess the place we're going to head next, and I probably will even do a cut for it because it is very far away, is up here maybe. So, uh, yeah, I would say let's do like a cut up here. Let's go to the first station around here. There you go. Let's, we'll head. Th I'll head there, and then we'll be back here in a minute, and uh, that way we can just go ahead and... Um, 
I guess I can do our afterburner nonstop without any issues now. Uh, that way we can uh, head over there and uh, see what's going on and uh, explore a bit more. So we'll be back in a minute. Okay, look at this system. Boy, I haven't even paid attention to some of these systems here. Holy crap. I probably was too busy in scanner mode and never got to enjoy this uh, system up like this. There you go. I don't think I saw this ore. Well, I've, I mean, I've seen this ore a couple times anyways, multiple times, but uh, I don't think I've seen it in this brightness. Maybe I have. Is that, can you do anything with the scrap? I don't think so. The only scrap I've seen was in the, the one wormhole, but uh, yeah. Uh, so this one has, well, this one is not going to be very useful as a shipyard, but uh, yeah, it doesn't have uh, anything else, so that's all right. Yeah, we need, we need markets at this point, so uh, we're working our way up here, so nothing there. And two stations up here, so let's go over there. And that way we can uh, go there and then it has some forking so we can check out that so we're, we're still exploring a little slower obviously but that's why I did the one cut there you know backtracking kind of thing because I didn't want you to have to suffer I'm a nice guy these are just bigger versions of them they have this or quite a bit here don't they <laughs> just gets bigger and bigger the next one that you, you just like you have to like steer around it'll just be like the whole sector is just nothing but one of those see I told you <laughs> no that's something different okay so uh, we got two stations here right so this one and mass market oh when they say mass market it sounds like a marketing hub so I mean it's probably not gonna really be what you know one would think but technically it sounds like it would have a lot of stuff there so fun I check the shipyards meh and then the market so what do we have for here prototype so prototype afterburner yes we will be picking up one of those anyways for now or do we want to pick up two of those why pick up two of them yeah I think I will um, so we already did max capacity oh this is an energy capacitor so the other one was a recharge this one it increases your maximum capacity I don't think we really need to do that though so I'm gonna ignore that um, but I mean obviously that could be uh, pretty useful for some people um, and then uh, we were still looking for say lasers I mean we have what we have probably for now so uh, let's see here I'd rather just get the same ones, to be honest, at this point, just because we're already used to them. Unless there's like a, a level 3 better version or something. Okay, and then, um, I mean, we could look for a scanner too, to be honest. Scanner. Nothing there, yeah. Just put the laser there so I remember. I guess I can always just go through this too and check out what there is. Okay. So let's actually put some of this stuff on because we hadn't before. Plus, we want this on for sure. So this will make us go a little faster, obviously. <laughs> At least for the afterburner, which is not too bad. Once you got that control, like when you're going that right direction, just burning that thing off would be uh, that's pretty awesome. So, and then we're gonna go to this one. So you want to wait till you get that right angle, right? So 76 is our fastest speed, right? Now with the afterburner, 400. So. That afterburner really changes the game of things here. Okay, and you do have a market here. Awesome. So what's up in this area here? So I'm just looking at basic shield booster. Interesting. Oh, so it increases your shield somehow? Yeah, one point. I don't understand how a module shield booster works to be fair. It's kind of interesting though. Yeah, nothing too exciting there. Let's just search for the uh, lasers here. So these are the X2 ones. We want the uh, the X3 we have basically, so. Okay, nothing good there. And prototype. 
Scam booster. Don't really need that. Uh, so we're good on that. Okay. Let's keep going, shall we? So we got, well, everything you can think of to uh, search here. So, um... I guess this is what we came through, so I won't even touch that so I don't accidentally go through it right now. And then just go to these guys here. So if I do caps on the booster, will I overshoot or will it turn? I think if you the afterburner is what overshoots you a lot of times, so you might be better off just waiting till it aligns and then, you know. Oh, this one just screwed up. That's all right. We're going towards our target now, so. This one has two stations and then a jump somewhere else too, so. We overshot, I guess. <laughs> oh, nothing uh, here for us, so. Darn it. Okay, so, undock here. Do we want to go through that or check the... We should probably check the other station first, because more than likely, I'll just end up uh, forgetting. You know what I mean? And we're going to not mark this, so we know which one to go through, basically. Uh, on our way back. Because it's going to continue. Yeah. Five, six minutes in this space with our life support right now. And our life support's actually pretty good. Like, what the hell? <laughs> Mark it. Uh, okay, so life support. Anything godlike here? Uh, what is the eco something? So thermal 35. I think we already have uh, something better, but uh, I'm not sure, to be honest. Oh, actually, maybe we don't. Was it this one? Thermal? Yeah, this is 27. Thermal. So, no, maybe that is better. I don't even know if we can find better. I think this might be one of the best ones we've actually seen, to be fair. So, let's buy that then. And, uh, yeah. So, that'll, that'll help a bit, right? There you go. And then, uh, yeah, we'll get rid of you. We don't want you. Okay. And then, okay. So, we got that. Um, let's look for a laser. Okay, nothing too exciting there. We can't use that. No, we can't. Oh, we can use the level fours, not the level threes. But what are we using right now? That's not a good laser, anyways. I don't think, is it? Man, I haven't screwed up with my lasers now. Seventeen. Are you listed as seventeen as well? Yeah, you are seventeen. Oh, it is item level four. Okay. Yeah, we'll just keep with what we have then. Mark it, and then, uh, so let's look for the passives here. Prototype, just one. That sucks. And then, uh, I didn't scroll through here for anything interesting. Nothing really interesting here. I just like to look through it, kind of, you know. Um, okay, so, uh, let's undock here. So, seven minutes and something here. That's not too, too bad. Okay, so we need to go to this one here, right? Yeah, there you go. Guess we can mark this because we know where we're going now out of here. What's this stuff back here anyways? Oh, okay. Have it. Okay. Woo. So this is something I'm doing wrong, I guess. Um, where I'm like, I'm trying to stop it from doing whatever, but I can't now. So it's like, it's being stupid on me. Okay. Is there anything in this system anyways? No. Okay. We're good anyways. So yeah, like when you, when I play with something on my way out, it kind of screws out and it just kind of auto goes and I'm not sure what's happening but obviously you're, you're noticing it happen right so yeah that turbo doesn't work well um, until you line up so it's it's more of a manual thing basically once we get maybe some ship turning it'll help but uh, I'm guessing afterburners maybe not overshoot it as much it's probably just yeah the uh, or not the afterburners the uh, thrusters but it's probably the afterburners that are shooting it over all the time so that might help us figure out what's going on with some of the other things. So now we're going to go to this bean dust one and then the K one after. There we go. So dead end. That makes that one easy. 
Let's see what it looks like. That's pretty cool. What's this? Some of that Zayor. Okay. And now we're going to this one. Okay, what we got here? Um, nothing in the system except another jump gate, obviously, so that's always good, but uh, yeah, nothing exciting. Wait, have we gone through this before? No. Yeah, no, I'm so confused. We're in here right now? Oh, okay. Oh, it might have connected in between two. What? Oh, okay. I think that's what happened there. Oh, okay. Um, well, let's go to this one then, I guess. Yeah, okay. I guess we had explored, like, the top one and the bottom one, and then these just two connected, I guess? I don't know. I'm so confused. Our poor life support ain't gonna last long here. Whoa, if it's bad here, where the hell was it really bad? Oh no, this is not gonna be good. Okay, well, hopefully we'll survive wherever we go here in a second. Um, the only reason I say that is our life support is 25% and dropping, and it's wherever we were that caused that. So, oh no hazard here, okay, good. Yeah, we're gonna go to mass market and dock first. We can't, uh, don't want to take the chance here. Can I, like, force? There you go. It's, like, oddly enough, but you can move yourself faster. <laughs> don't ask. Okay, um, so we're here, and we don't need to be here, so we'll get out of here. And then we decided we were going to go, oh, okay, never mind. Maybe, I don't know, maybe I'm an idiot. Maybe I had this wrong. Oh, so we, oh, we might have marked the one we came through then. I don't know. This is one of those things that I can't tell you too much on. Oh, we gotta go upwards. I don't think I'm helping it, to be fair. I was just thought I'd try to help it a bit, but now I think about it, I'm like, probably not making it work well. There we go. I don't even think we're... Okay. This one's off pretty far, too. Seven minutes in the system. Well, there is nothing in here to be worth while anyway, so there you go. So what are we looking at now here? So have we found it all, or we got some stuff here that we haven't found yet for trade? No, I would say we found it all. Crazy. Well, I want to look for more modules, so, hmm. I'm going to go down to this one and go up. So we'll be back here in a second. I'll head that way and see. Is there a station in there? Yeah, there is. Okay. That's going to take a bit, but uh, we'll let it do its thing here and then come back here in a second. Okay, so we're in pirate space, and uh, we had misses one spot, the Archon place, so I thought I'd go ahead and check that one out. And uh, what I might do is just off camera, uh, do a bit of checking on the uh, other uh, pirate areas near their end, and just seeing if I can see any some prototype modules, and then we'll cut to them. Uh, that way uh, we won't have like... Uh, a 40 episode part on getting modules <laughs> and there's always going to be probably other modules out there that are better things like that right but at least we'll have an idea but exploration is kind of fun to do together yeah there's nothing here look at the wreckage there through the this stuff you can see it but you don't see it without it <laughs> so yeah this system was a bust um, so I think that might be it for the pirates. Uh, their area I think is fully explored now or no dragon. Oh no, that's the wormhole. Yeah. So we got that done and then trade is fully explored and then alpha is fully explored. So we're getting there. We have, uh, that still does, we still have three, uh, other factions though we have to work on. So we have a lot of work to do. It's interesting that, oh, these are considered alpha. So the wormholes that you open up, I guess, are alpha. It'd be kind of cool if they were like a different one, but sure. 
I'm, I'm guessing they do it that way for just to be your faction sort of thing. I, I guess maybe because he thinks maybe one day there'll be some sort of faction restrictions or something. I'm not, I'm not really sure why it would be that way, but it is that way. So, um, like I said, I will go ahead and I'll just check some stations out, see if I can find anything interesting. Um, and then, uh, if not, well, uh, that'll, I'll just keep looking. I'll, I'll go in alpha next and go through that. So, uh, we'll definitely get some more modules. Okay, look what I just found in the market. So I found an advanced warp drive. Um, I didn't realize it was a little expensive here. Look at the base price of it. <laughs> um, but uh, anyways, yeah, 68 million credits for the advanced warp drive. So um, I guess that one is uh, it's definitely worth it down the, the road. Um, this powerful module will provide any ship with the ability to travel to light speed using warp drive technology. Warp drives require electron orbs and energy source to operate properly. So, 80% uh, to warp drive. Now, that's the advanced one. I mean, there might be a less advanced one, but uh, uh, literally, I just saw that there, and I'm like, what? Like, usually everything is like, yeah, usually it's like the, the name at the beginning is based on what level it is, but then I saw that one. Look at the prototypes here, though. Armor, drone, energy, uh, engine core, that sucks. Um, shield capacity, that's actually, you know what, I might grab the shield one. A little expensive, but 30% uh, to shields, why not? So, do we have a garage here? Yeah, so we got, there's your shields there. So if we throw this puppy in here, look at your shields now. Boom. That's a huge jump. I mean, uh, you can easily, that's the cool thing with the... Uh, the passive slots is you can really armor things and then on top of that your skill so you could really get some crazy creations on there but at least that'll help us with that anyways um, so I'll keep searching for um, I'll keep searching for some stuff here I, I look for scanners already here right yeah yeah out of stock on this one and nothing new on the passive so yeah I'll keep going on that Oh, look at this. I didn't think I'd get thermal up any higher, but here we go. 44% to this one. This is the level uh, 5 Omicron. We had this one, right? The level 4. So, uh, yeah, that's definitely going to be a boost. It's going to be a bit expensive, but uh, it'll definitely be worth it. I can't even place it on here. <laughs> they even have the food here. Um, that's good. We don't need that, though. Um, let's check out uh, passive modules here. Prototype, what do we got here? Armor, cargo expansion. Um, didn't I buy some of those for something? I feel like I did. I kind of want to get that because I would like to have... Uh, yeah, for some cases, if you want to increase it, why not? Yeah, let's do that. Prototype engine. Oh, yeah, that's that one. That's the stupid thing, so we don't want that. So this is good. Even if I don't use these now, I can just, you know, that'll increase my uh, cargo by... 100% uh, but as far as I know that's based on the base so the skills can't just like jump on each other and like keep going and going and going as far as I know so I um, don't think you can just like kind of uh, get some insane numbers and end up having like a billion uh, uh, cargo space with that but that'll help uh, quite a bit so I'm going to keep looking for other items here oh and I didn't check our lasers quickly here the X3 no I keep seeing everything else but our lasers here Generic large laser. Isn't the level 4 what we're using? That's so confusing. Why is there different ones? It's because it has different turn rates on it. So this is a turn rate of 55. Um, what's our turn rate? Like, oh, I can't even look at it on here. And it's not going to show it on here. The only way to look at it is to get out. But yeah, this, some of these are a little, hmm. Yeah, turn rate could be a, actually a pretty important one, can it? I wonder what the strength is. I wonder if that's damage or that's another type of strength. Anyways, um, yeah, I'll keep looking. Okay, look at this. We got uh, guys to go for for once. I'm going to fight them or attempt to fight them here. Um, so these guys, what's the range on these anyways? These guys are like, I guess like six or 700. Oh, wow. Well, they definitely do a lot more damage. Oh, wow. Okay. The, that was crazy, and that's regular speed there, so they kind of went crazy on that. 
Um, that that was wicked. How fast they went. This is why I like this ship too. Um, if we get this like up and running decently enough, that you know when I'm running missions, I'd rather just run this one because usually when I'm running missions, the reason you know I'm kind of stuck using uh, the the scout is because it's faster and easier to get around. I found the other one a little slower and it didn't have a lot of utility to it anyways. But now that this could have easily a lot of utility to it, I wouldn't even need that many lasers, things like that. Has lots of space too. Um, I could definitely, um, you know, use this to do my missions. Yeah, it'd be a bit slower to get there. It's not going to be like godlike. But at the same time, if I get some of the upgrades put on here, it won't be too, too bad too. So... Oh, here we go. Well, I'm, I'm here at a station, so I might as well put these uh, on here for fun. So I'm low on space, but then again, I have extra stuff on here anyways for fun. And these ones you don't really need unless you just want to do it for fun. But okay, maybe this works better than I thought it would. Okay, I did not realize I would have that much space. <laughs> 11,119 uh, space now. Okay, I like that. Um, this has no market on this one, funny enough, but uh, life support. So what were we getting? We we're getting out uh, you, right? The regulator? Yeah, so we got a better regulator now. There's obviously going to be a better filter, probably p potentially better uh, waste uh, waste as well. So uh, that's actually kind of good. So we're going to be able to min-max this even a bit more. I'm going to hold on to this for, like, say, another ship or whatever, I guess. Um, but, uh, you know, this is going really good so far. So, I mean, I have more passives, like the cargo is just for fun, right, really, than anything, but uh, um, I'd obviously wouldn't put all the those in there. This, potentially, I would keep on these, those two, just because, you know, right now in our current condition, I really need them. But, uh, you know, certain things like even the energy generator might not even need, right? That might be useful, might not need it, you know, things like that. So I'm going to have to learn and play around with that. But, uh, yeah, keep it on looking. Okay, so we're back home. I think we're going to just end it here because, uh, you know, it's taken a while. And I'm going to crawl through Alpha Sector a bit and see if I can find anything, you know, to fill in the, the, the stuff there. But I think we've done pretty good here. And then next time when we come back, hopefully, you know, I think next time we come back, I'm actually going to try to take this through the worm. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm going to be just stupid and see how fast it takes to get myself killed, basically. Uh, that, that sounds like a fun goal, right? Um, but anyways, uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much what I'm going to do there. Um, and, uh, yeah, so I'll just keep, uh, exploring and checking things out. I mean, obviously these ones just going to suck here. Everything sucks here. Um, cause it's not the premium, right? You got, actually it goes up to advanced, which is pretty incredible. So, um, uh, but, uh, anyways, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.